All right, you guys. Uh, I'm a trucker, and I'm about to show you a, a resistance band workout that you can do in a very confined space. With us uh, truckers, uh, a lot of times the problem uh, becomes not having an, enough time or uh, resources, opportunities to uh, exercise like we need to. And when it's cold outside like it is in Montana right now where I'm at, uh, you don't really want to go outside You could because it's dangerous uh, on the ice, it's dangerous. But you can at least do a few things in the truck, in your space. Now, I have this set up, I've been doing lunges. What I do is stick the uh, my, my feet, step on it, like so, and I uh, pull up, pull up, and, and when you go down, you're at the weakest point, as you go up you get stronger, but the tension gets uh, stronger. Also you can do a whole bunch of exercises in this, in this space right here, stand on it, you can do curls. Stand on it. Go wider for more resistance. Shorten your, uh, close your leg, uh, your feet for less resistance. You can do shoulder presses. There's, there's a whole bunch of videos on YouTube if you're looking for. Uh, uh, more information on uh, workouts with in, uh, resistance bands. Specifically for this video, uh, I'd like to show you where I where I place my for for a tricep workout. Inside, I'll run it through here and do a uh, tricep workout. I'll uh, stand on them and do shoulders. You can stand on them and do, uh, you, you work out your back. And in a later video, I'll show you all uh, in the back, there's places where I hook the resistance bands up to the trailer and do exercises with them. Now I'll do that in another video. I don't want to do that now. It's cold outside and I'm about ready to go. So, the the type of resistance band I like to use is uh, fitness gear. I get them at uh, Dick's Sporting Goods. It's a pretty good place, pretty cool place. And for all you truckers out there, uh, uh, another thing I've noticed is uh, it's really easy to gain weight. So. What I like to do, oh, and it's really, it can get really expensive. So, uh, to cut down on the expense of food, I've, I went with this. Huel is pretty good. It, it's actually not that bad tasting. And that I replaces a, uh, about, uh, I can only, I can get away with one meal a day. Uh, one hot meal a day, like in a restaurant. I'll eat good one meal a day, and I'll save a buttload of money. Okay, uh, that's it for now, that's all I got, and uh, I'll show you all the, the outside, what I'd like to do on the outside later. Thanks for watching, bye.